right, here we go. So uh, here we have the magnifier with auxiliary clip. So this is kind of like a mini soldering station. Um, we're going to unbox it and then we're gonna try to maybe solder something with it. But first we have to assemble it, of course. So let's have a look at the box here. This is the box. It's like a magnifying, uh, a place to put your soldering iron and a little clip for, uh, for a PCB, whatever you're soldering. Um, nothing much to it, I guess. Um, let's see what do we have here. ACDC. So yeah, it is a USB. It has a little USB lamp on it. And it has a USB charging cable. This is the lamp. Magnifying glass, let's see on the back here. So magnifying lens, metal hose, adjusting knob, and so on. All the ingredients uh, over here on the side. It's kind of useful auxiliary tool to workers. Why would you say it's kind of is kind of useful <laughs> on your own product? So is it useful or not? <laughs> kind of. Great, great. I love it. And yeah, let's open it up. So, um, and yeah, you can see here to scale. So we have the USB cable. Here the parts, let's take these out of the bag. Oh, the camera just went out of focus. And while we're at it, we can zoom out, zoom back out, I guess. Here we go. What else is in the box? The magnifying glass. Take that out of the bag. Much faster like this. The bigger magnifying glass. And a mini glass here. And what else is in the bag? I guess the stand. That's right. The stand. What else? And yeah. And then what else is in here? Instructions, I guess. Assembly instructions. We're gonna need that, I guess. So uh, let me get in Chinese on one side and in English in the other one. Let's have a look here. Slurry clip, magnifier, LED, TE-800, a useful aid, that's why I bought it, and so, looks simple enough to assemble, okay, let's leave that here, it's out of the way, and let's see, so um, yeah, the stand, it's the stand, the LED, I guess um, it needs batteries here, there are no batteries, but I will find some right now, if I can, batteries, batteries, right over here. So I'm not sure if these are charged, but yeah, we're gonna... Three different ones, you shouldn't be doing that, but yeah. Hopefully they uh, they have some juice in them. Let's install them. So yeah, they just install like that, no problem. Cover back on. And let's test it. Okay, yeah, great. Blind the camera, yeah. So yeah, a little LED light. Flip a switch. Great. And okay, so what's next? I guess um, this must be the easy part. This is for the soldering iron. Place that in here. Or do you know? I don't think so. Sit. 
Doesn't seem like it wants to fit. Maybe there's something else that goes in there. Um, not really. Okay. So I guess, well, let's... Um, this has to be on like this. So you adjust that like that. Um, and then... Then... Hmm. Just running this through without any instructions. You shouldn't actually be needing anything. How does this go? Let's have a look at the box. This, uh... Okay, so there's like a little clip here. I guess this is the clip. And this clip, okay, yeah, now I get it. So, oh. that's too far. So one of them goes on here, like this. And the other one goes here, yeah, okay, now I get it. Kind of difficult to do it with. Okay, but yeah. Okay, yeah, that works kind of pretty good. It's tight, yeah, it's easy to adjust, easy to tighten. I'm liking it. Alright, uh, so what's next? So then, okay, so that's that's how it gets done. I'm just wondering, what is this for? This is for... What is this for? Is this for the magnifying glass? Magnifying glass, yeah. So this goes like that. And... Okay. Okay, yeah, it is. It is. For the magnifying glass. So, you tighten that. And it stays on, yeah, no problem. And then you tighten this, please. Okay, no problems, yeah, looks good. Let's uh, get it all the way to the top, I guess. And this one a little bit lower. We have the LED. Okay, yeah, we're uh, we're getting there. Now we're just uh, just these alligator clips, and same thing here. I guess this goes like that. To be tightened a little bit. These clips in. Okay, yeah. Stays. Yeah, seems to be. Uh, seems like it's it's holding on. I guess I'm not sure I, uh, maybe I want it like this from the top. Okay, so there's one. And the other one.
here we go yeah so yeah it's uh the assembly looks like it's done it's complete everything can be adjusted here let's see if uh, we can um get get the raspberry pi or something with the okay maybe this one here let's see if we can clip that down just to see how it looks like so I guess one one like this one simply here or I guess in reverse because you want to you want to have access to the pins here so let's let's do that in reverse and yeah here we go that's um that looks kind of yeah, it looks like it's finished ready to to solder let's see if we can show you that and yeah you have the little magnifying glass on the side here and then you have the big one i'm not sure if this is upside down no it shouldn't be it should be like this. So yeah, there you have it. It's fully assembled. Oh no, we're missing this part. Um, and yeah, I just uh, just couldn't get this in. So you have to really kind of push it in. Let's see. Okay, yeah, that's what it is. And the screw, I guess, was blocking it. Okay. More or less. It's it seems solid. It seems really solid in there. So yeah. Um and then we also have this little clip here, this little um, smaller magnifying glass. Not sure which way let's, are they both the same? Let's see. So that that makes things bigger. And the opposite as well yeah it's i guess it's double-sided i'm not sure if there's a difference uh both of the lens are rounded so it should be the same so we have this little magnifying glass with the big one and here with the light you can't really see anything but um not sure if i will be using this one I can't even show you that in camera Okay, well, it looks better. It looks better um, in real. But I think I, I still, I, I don't think I will be using this. You can just move it to the side here like that underneath. And then that will be it. So. Yeah, but as far as for soldering, this, this is much better. It looks much better um, with naked eye, just, you know, instead of just on the camera here. See if I can zoom in here. But yeah, there you have it. So yeah, now if you were going to solder something, and the part is already clamped in, and it's you just secure it a little bit, and then um, you get the soldering iron and a little bit of solder. And yeah, if I were to, to try to solder something, I guess this would have made my life a little bit easier. You put the wire through, touch the leads, and it looks, looks kind of simple. Now, I am going to make a part two of this video where I'm actually soldering something. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, now let's see. Uh, let's just check, make sure everything that works here. Uh, LED lamp quite useful now if I um, if you don't want the LED lamp there's something that I, I figured 
that instead of uh, using taking out the LED lamp and putting uh, one of these alligator clips um, instead onto here or something like that, you know, like kind of like securing it here because the LED lamp is cool, but if we can also have like a clip here, you know, an extra like say you wanted to attach a wire this this can be done if you can hot glue it or epoxy glue it somewhere here or something like that uh, not necessarily with this but even maybe even remove the lamp and uh try jam it in there and just you know like secure it in place in there with some screws something like um or even using something like from from the other workstation that i got which is something like a clip that kind of at the end of these wires see they're the same they're pretty much the same so just taking this off and just putting it onto here and so you instead of having a lamp you have a little alligator clip and that can be quite useful because yeah the light is great but yeah i already have enough and i you know so and then um yeah we have this usb cable here and why why do we have that oh i guess we have it to to charge the batteries what okay wait so the lamp turned off when i plug this in so i guess why why do we have this why is this cable here i don't even know we have the batteries there maybe because it can be powered from from usb so let's uh let's find out Let me just uh a battery here going okay let's uh, make a little power bank here and let's see if we plug this in okay yeah so you don't need the batteries there you go so I guess um, I guess it works both ways it works with with, um, with the AAA batteries and it works off a USB bank or you just simply USB plug it into the computer or whatnot so I'm just gonna try it I'm curious about this what if I remove the batteries this is nice a nice light 5 LED but as we are reviewing it let's do a good job let's see if we remove the batteries will it work I think it will. I think it has kind of like a switch that kills. Um, I think I would prefer to run it with the batteries. Just leave the batteries in there and and but yeah, just test it with USB here. And oh yeah, here we go. Yeah, so yeah, it does work. So the USB bank. Great, and uh, is it actually useful? Can we actually get some extra light here? Up underneath, I guess, yeah, well, kind of. I guess you can kind of even put it like this. That's kind of, that's a little bit better. So yeah, there you have it. The, the little workbench here. Quite useful. This is the magnetic magnifier with auxiliary clip. Simple workbench. And yeah, I, I'm going to use it quite a bit because I was kind of soldering with uh, just um, using a little bit of blue tag and, and plasticine just to secure. But this is so much better. Um, I actually bought two of these. I'm gonna make like a little soldering workstation. This is the other one that I bought. If you're interested, the video is in my channel. Um, Another, another great and this one does have the alligator clips and little um, magnetic everything's magnetic here and it's movable and you can insert the PCB in between these clamp it down and um, just between the edge and it's, it's really a good piece of um, soldering equipment so if you're interested in that the videos in my channel as well um, but yeah that's uh, that's going to be it for this um for this uh, video and if you liked it hit like and subscribe and um check out the other videos probably you'll find something interested as well see you later
Thank you.